This is the home page of the Microchip Portal. Along the left-hand side, you'll see a Manage menu where you can manage details about your portal. Your device list should be empty, and you can click here to add a new Microchip device to your portal. There's currently two types of devices listed, and we're going to use the development platform for CDMA. To add the device, we have to enter the device MEID from the location on the picture shown on the bottom of your device. You can use any device name and also any device location. Uh, the location, of course, can be updated later via GPS. Now we can hit continue to add the device. It should be added successfully. And now we have to go out to the Twist M2M website to provision the device for cellular. The Twist M2M website uses the MEID for the username and you have to sign up to create a password. Once you're logged in, you'll see there's an M2M settings tab. And on that page, there's an Exocyte CIK. Go back to the microchip portal, copy the CIK shown, and then go back to the Twist website and paste the CIK value in that field. Scroll down to the bottom of the page, click Submit Changes, and you'll see a Save Complete. Now you're all set up. Now data should be flowing. So let's go back and let's quit. And we'll see our devices there. Let's go to our home page. And if you remember, the device list used to be blank. Now there's our device. And we can click on the device to go to the dashboard showing data from the device. And as you can see here, data is already flowing from the device. The different widgets on this page show the data in different ways. And this widget is showing temperature data. And we can zoom in and see the specific data points. This is a gauge widget. And this is a map widget showing the device location from actual GPS data being reported. Across the top, we have given you a couple of shortcuts to be able to customize your portal quickly. And let's go ahead and look at the Manage menu. The Data menu shows the devices with all of the specific data uh, that's assigned to the device. The Devices menu shows all of your devices. If you click on a given device, you'll see the details about the device, including the data and the CIK that we used earlier. The Scripts page shows different real-time processing elements in your portal, the Events page, email and SMS alerts, the Dashboards, Views into your data, and the Admin page allows you to manage roles and permissions in your portal. And that's it. That's an overview of the Microchip Portal. We hope that you take what we've done here and extend it, and feel free to drop us a line about the things you've created.